RTA trolleys are decked out and ready for the All-Star Week. So too is the Transit System, which offers tens of thousands of baseball fans the best option for getting daily in and out of downtown. Parking's at a premium, roads are closed, there's reroutes. I mean, today we even heard the hotels are sold out. It's going to be busy downtown and it's going to be congested and you don't want to have your car as a burden to you. Part of that extra service around peak times they plan for, part of it, Place. Our service people may not know, it actually starts at 3 in the morning. And I know bars are open till 4, so we have you covered both ways. You happen to be getting home at 4 in the morning, there's actually a train that'll get you home. For those who waited for hours in long lines for a train three years ago after being told to take RTA to the Cavs championship parade, fear not. That was an anomaly, a day where they literally saw triple the volume of their busiest day. The all-star game events will be spread out. Except for those west side users of the red line, there will be one hiccup. The shuttle buses will be in use around work on a retaining wall between West 117th and West Boulevard that couldn't be avoided. It's about a minute or two delay. It's unfortunate, but for safety reasons, we have to shut that section of the rail. Starting June 30th, that's what, that's what you'll see. If you want to get part of that time back, you can purchase your tickets in advance on the RTA mobile app and avoid the hassle and time of the ticket machines. In Cleveland, John Kasich. News 5.